national anthem. here at Buckeye Local High School. The Panthers taking on the Beavers of Beaver Local. First time this season. Panthers are, I do believe, 0-3 on the early season. Beaver Local lost a tough one to Liverpool, so I'm not sure what their record is at this point. But we're ready for the tip. And here's the official. The tip is up. Panthers control tip. Stevie Roberts with possession. Panthers coming to the front court. Looks like Beaver Local playing man to man. There's Jake Maley in the corner with the jumpers up and short on line. Nice rebound by Hunter Dara. And that's going to be a jump ball. And that'll be possession to the Beavers. Here comes Beaver local point guard, Luke Cheetok, the junior guard. And that's number 20, Josh Hilditch, junior as well. They're gonna run a little weave action. Cooper Grabitz with some nice defense. Here comes a drive middle. Oh, a couple steps extra. Here's a set three pointer is gonna be up and good by Logan Reed, the junior. Here comes Beaver looking to add some pressure now, man to man. Not much of pressure. <clears throat> Pants is going to screen down. There's a nice pass to Cameron Grabitz. Out top to Maley. Maley's going to shuffle. Looks nice pass inside of Hunter Dara. Nice pass back inside to, to Maley. 
It's 3-2. Nice patient possession by the Panthers. Here comes Beaver Local back the other way now. They continue to move the ball around the perimeter. There's a drive, and they're going to get Hunter Dara with a reach. Panthers down a couple players tonight. Luke Dara, who injured his hand, and Jake Moffo, who is out sick. So the Panthers are shorthanded. There's a wide open three-pointer again, set three-pointer again by Reeves. No good. Rebound Dara, who throws it to Roberts, who can't handle it. And that'll end up in the student section. And that'll be a turnover for the Panthers. Beaver inbounds. Panthers playing man, little matchup zone looks like. Nice rebound almost on the back side. We're gonna get a foul on Beaver local. Jake Maley drawing that foul, and here comes the Beaver pressure. There's the inbound to Stevie Roberts. Beaver's going to look to do nothing on there. Owen Long setting the screen up to high post. Little screen down, here comes Maley up top. Nothing there, back down, here comes Long. Screen by Maley. It's a push off by the Beavers. Long at the top is going to get it back over to Roberts, and the Panthers are going to reset. Coach Heaton calling out the plays, first-year coach. And there's a turnover by Roberts, and there's a deep pass. Good hustle by the Panthers to get back. Dara, oh, almost gets in. There's a rebound by Dara. The grip and rip. Here's the trap. Now, Roberts needs some help. No, he's going to clear it himself. Here comes the Panthers the other way. He's going to dribble off his foot. Owen Long with the hustle to gain possession. Just the pass to Gravitz on the wing. Gravitz is going to get from the screen from Maley. That's going to be out of bounds. Another turnover for the Panthers. We're still stuck at 3-2 with 5.15 left. There's the pull of three up, in and out. Jake Maley with the rebound again. He's going to draw another foul. That's the second foul now. Jake Maley's drawn on the rebound. <clears throat> Panthers are going to get some pressure here. Let's see what the... They're not going to pressure on the out-of-bounds man. There's a screen by Roberts. Not much of a pressure, but you know they're going to come get you here eventually. Oh, and Long with the screen. Nice job there. Stevie Roberts with possession over to Maley in the middle, or in the corner. Uh, shot up, no good. Coming back the other way. And that's going to be a turnover, Beaver Local. So slow start here, 3-2. Here we come back the other way now. Grabitz with possession. Gravitz going to get the ball to the wing to Maley. Maley's going to kick it out to Dara. He's going to reverse it to Gravitz. Baseline drive, and we're going to get a push, and that'll be the third team foul now against Beaver Local. Could be a big possession here. Panthers will be baseline. Looks like Long's going to set the screen for Gravitz, who's going to throw it. Up for the three, short, good look though. Panthers struggling from the field, which has been the story all season. Getting good looks tonight. Playing good defense as well, and there's a foul on Long. That'll be his first personal, team second. And we're still stuck at three too. So Beaver will have the ball side out of bounds. Panthers again. I think they're in their matchup zone. Here comes Beaver Local with a play called through. So let's see what they try to line up here. Here's the overload baseline. 
Good job by Stevie Roberts with the pick. Oh, and he can't finish. So good steal, but no finish. Grabbits now with the pressure. Good job. Long's going to stay down. Nice turn. There's a spin dish underneath up and good. Nice pass. It's now five to two. The Panthers have a little issue inbound. There's Grabbits with the ball. We come back the other way now. Here's Gravitz going to attack the middle. Nobody's stepping up. He's going to shoot it. No good. Dara can't get the rebound, and we're back the other way now. Here's the underhand pass. Dish to up. No good. Dara with the rebound to Long. Here comes Alan Long to the front court. 5 2, three minutes remaining in the first quarter. Buckeye ball, top of the key. Back up to Darrow, over to Gravitz. Here comes Long baseline. Almost there. Owen oh, Long's in the corner. In, nice pass into Darrow, who can't handle it. And that'll be another turnover. Number three. That was Beaver Loco the other way. We got three, a couple subs getting ready to come in. High post, low post. Pass inside. Maley goes up. I think they're going to get a foul on maybe Jake Maley. Let's see. No, foul's on Owen Long. That's his second. Team third. First one's up and good. That's two. 27 remaining in the first quarter. So Gravitz will come out. And we have Mason Brown into the game, number 33. Second shot is up, and it's good. 7 to 2. Panthers need to hoop. We've had some opportunities, just unable to finish. Here comes Mainly now at the point, bringing the ball up. There's the handoff to Roberts. Roberts to Long, back to Dara up top of the key. Oh, nice back cut by Mainly. The jump stop, score, and the basket. Nice job by Jake Mainly. They're going to get the foul on Beaver. Foul number four, that's his, or number two, excuse me, that's his second. No, that's his first. I don't know, I'm going by what the scoreboard tells me. Obviously, I can't count on that. So, seven to four now. Nice job by Jake Maley, who's at the line. Shot is up, and it's good as well. It's now seven to five. Here we go back the other way. Beaver Local with possession. Panthers back in their matchup zone. No, they're back in man. They're actually in man to man right now. Oh, and Long with the take. Up, no good on the defense, and that'll be two for the Beavers. Here comes Stevie Roberts. To Mason Brown, back to Roberts. Better release, better release. We're going to get five seconds, and that's a turnover for the five-second call. So the old five-second call, you can't stand there with being close at guard and not do anything with the ball. So five-second call, and that's a fourth turnover for the Panthers. The score is 9-5, to five, 123 remaining in the first quarter. Panthers have had some opportunities. Now back to zone, the matchup zone. Mason Brown almost with the steal. There's a drive middle. Dara with the almost block. Beavers laid in. It's 11 to 5 now. Here comes Beaver local. Pressuring the ball up high. Panthers are going to have some opportunities to attack the basket. 
Stevie Roberts with the spin and the shot, no good. Offensive rebound, Mason Brown, who's going to save it, but it's going to go into the hands of Beaver Local, who's going to come the other way. And that's going to be an easy two. Beaver Local attacking the basket now. It's 13 to 5. Dara with the baseline spin move. Pass cross court to Roberts. Going to ball fake and then shoot the three. No good. Nice rebound, Dara. Shot up and good. 13 7. Here's the double screen top of the key. The three-pointer's up. No good. Rebound to Beaver. And they're going to get a baseline foul. First one up, no good. Four, four seconds remaining, second one up, and that's good. So Sub Beaver Local now, four seconds left to play. It's 14-7. Shot up, no good. At the end of one, it's 14 to seven. There we go. Got the scoreboard issue fixed. My bad. So it's going to be Panther possession. Starts the second quarter, 14-7. Team fouls are 4-4. Four four. Panthers have some opportunities. I'm not sure what's going on. We got a substitution issue here going on with the Beaver. Okay, and now we're underway. Here comes Gravis the other way, up top. A shot by Maley in the corner, and it's up and in and out. Here comes Beaver Loki the other way. Nobody stops the old Euro step, which I am not a fan of. Nice rebound by Dalton Watt. Here we come the other way, Mason Brown. Hand off to Cooper Gravitz, or Cameron Gravitz, my bad. Grab is going to drive the jump stop. Nice dish down to Dara. Nice pass inside to Maley. Can't handle it. Back to Walt. Watt for three. Up, no good. Panthers all over the rebound. Oh, they're going to get Hunter Dara with a foul. Panthers had three players there, and they're going to get Dara with the foul. So 14-7 now, 7-18 left. That's the 15 foul now on the Panthers. Versus four against Beaver Local. 
Here comes Hilditch, the junior, bringing point, point guard, bringing the ball up for the Beavers. Reed, who's already got a three and a near make on the second one, now going to go to push on Novak inside. That's 16 fouls now. The Panthers are looking to put Beaver into the bonus early here in the second quarter. There's the inbound. Shot not there. Going to kick it back out to Reed. Here comes the run through on the backside. Not much movement otherwise. We got a screen, pull up, kick out to the backside. Three is up and it is good. That is Luke Cheetah, the junior with the three pointer. It's 17 to seven. Panthers need a basket. Here comes Grabitz. Bring the ball up. Hand off to Mason Brown. Over to Novak. Inside to Watt. Watt looking to be aggressive. Shot is up. No good. Beaver gets the rebound. Long court pass. Layup up. No good. Maley with another rebound. Cross court to Mason Brown. He's going to attack the basket. He's going to score. Nice fast break for the Panthers. Maley to Brown. Back the other way. Here's Reed again. Oh, Reed, whoops, falls down on that line. Here's a drive, and that's going to be an offensive foul, I do believe. They're going to call. Oh, man. They're going to call that on. They're going to get that on Dalton Watt, who was stationary, but they're going to call the foul as he tries to hop into him. So 17-9. And here's the sub. We're going to get 33 Hall in for number two, Barber, the sophomore. Hall, a senior, coming into the game. Here's the second shot now for Hilditch. Shot is up and no good. Hilditch shoot free throws like Sudbury, 0 for 2. Here we go back the other way, 550 remaining, 17 to 9. Here's the pass to Watt, over to Brown. Brown's gonna drive left side to Watt. Watt's gonna throw it up from three from the corner and that's gonna be good. Nice shot by Dalton Watt. The Panthers are within five now. Get some good defense, nice spark by Watt. Panthers again in the zone. There's the high post is open. That kid, if he does not wanna shoot it, kicks it out to 24 Reed who will chuck it up. Shot up, no good, rebound to Watt. We're going to get a jump ball. Nice. Dalton Watt hustling. Good job by Watt giving the Panthers a spark. We're going to get a timeout Panthers. 30-second timeout for Coach Heaton. Panthers are hustling. 5-14 remaining in the second quarter. There's the cheerleaders getting a little timeout action. Here into the student section. We're going to be back to action here in a minute. Up to 17 viewers in Panther Nation. 514 to half. Panthers within five. <coughs> Those of you just joining us, Panthers have some opportunities, but they're hustling. They're attacking the basket now here in the second quarter. And Beaver Local has not been able to take control of the tempo. So it'll be Beaver Local ball. I think over here in the corner. Team fouls are seven to four, so Beaver Local will be in the bonus the rest of the period. Let's see what kind of play we get lined up here. We got a little triangle. And we're going to get a corner. Throw back out. Watch the guy taking it out of bounds. Coming back around. Nice job by Grabitz on the defense. 
There's number 20 with the shot up, no good. Novak with the rebound over to Grabitz, and now the Panthers are running the other way. Up front to Maley. Maley's going to take a baseline. Oh, he's going to get bailed out with the block. A little body action. Frank Colabella. They're their longtime official. And it'll be Panthers' possession now. That's the fifth team foul. Just kick out to Maley. Over to Novak. Over to Mason Brown, who's going to ball fake. Baseline's open. There's Maley back baseline. Cross court to Novak. Back up to Dalton Watt. What ball fake. Cooper Gravis now going to, or Cameron Gravis going to take a baseline. Novak with a nice offensive rebound. Back to Watt. Oh, and the cross court pass going to be picked off. Beavers the other way. That's going to be a tough turnaround for the Panthers. Panthers with possession looking to score and cut it within three or two. And we get the turnover into two the other way. And now it's a seven point lead. Big turnaround. Here's the handoff up top. Grab it. Back court, nice back uh, cut there by Maley. Brown to Novak, inside to, looking to Watt, inside to Watt, there it is. Maley gets the loose ball, shot is up, the left hand shot, no good. Leaves it short. Come back the other way. Oh, there's an offensive foul. Oh my God, he caught a block. That's on the floor. There's no way that's a continuation. You can't count that basket. No way. No way. Oh my goodness. That's on the floor. It's on the floor. That's on the floor. Boo, that's terrible. Oh my goodness. They're gonna give him the and one continuation. I guess we're playing NBA rules now. Frank Colabella has been promoted to the NBA. Here's Gravitz back the other way. Now the Panthers have had opportunities. They're gonna have to cash in here. Get this back into single digits. There's another turnover. As Brown can't handle it. There's a layup the other way. Layup up and good. It's 24 to 12. Now the Panthers have doubled up. That quick. Now it's a 9-0 run by Beaver Local here. The last two minutes. Gravitz with pressure. We get it back over to Novak. He's going to get the three up. Up no good. Going to get his own rebound. Shot up no good. Good hustle by Novak. Back the other way now. Beaver Local looking to pressure. The ball down. We're going to get a block on Dalton Watt. So 24-12. Panthers are down a dozen. We've got some subs in. Roberts back in. And Jacob Zane's into the action for the Panthers. Shot up, and that's good. Three nineteen remaining in the second quarter. Nice rebound by Mason Brown. Pass the head to Jacob Zanes. The pull up is up and no good. Roberts gonna tip it to Brown, not there. Beaver gets it back, tips it ahead. Shot up and that's good. It's 27-12 and Coach Heaton's gonna get a timeout. As the Beavers now are on a 10-0 run.
So 3 of 3 remaining here. Back in action now. The Panthers with possession. Novak with the ball in the wing. Back out to Mason Brown. Up to Roberts. Over to Novak. Back cut. Nice job by Zanes. The floater's up. No good. Reed now on the back side with the spin. Nice behind the back pass. Nothing there from number 11. That is Tate Joseph. Three up, no good. Offensive rebound to the Beavers. Reed again driving. The shot is up and good. There's a putback, and now it's a 12-0 run. Novak looking to get the ball into Maley. Maley with the spin. Not much there. Back out to Novak. Over to Roberts. Roberts going to try to spin. Nice back cut, and that's going to be a turnover. There we go. Back the other way. Reed with the drive to the hoop. Shot is up. No good. Offensive rebound. Beaver. Nice follow. The roll run continues. It's 14 nothing now. Novak in the corner for three. Shot short. No good. And they're going to get a foul. That should be continuation, right? Down there to Mason Brown. Mason's going to turn. Shot is up and no good. Good luck. Beavers leaking out here. Oh, shot up and no good. And Roberts is going to punch the ball there. Well, he gives him a warning. First one's up and good. One twenty-six remaining in the second quarter. Second one is up and it is good. It's thirty-three to twelve now. There's a dry baseline by Zanes. A floater up, no good. Offensive rebound not there, and they're going to get a foul on Novak, and that's going to be two shots at the other end. Double bonus time, and it is 114 remaining, 33 to 12. Again, 16 nothing run by the Beavers here in the second quarter. Got some substitutions in. Number 11, P Lock, in for the game for the Panthers. And like Novak, maybe, out for the Panthers. First shot, second shot is up, and it is good as well. And it is now 34 to 12. Here comes the Panthers the other way, facing pressure. Mason Brown's going to look to drive the ball to the corner. Nothing there. Brings it back out wisely. Cross court to Roberts. There's a pass to Maley on the baseline or sideline. Loses the ball. Nice back cut by Mason Brown's going to attack the basket. He's going to get a block charge. Colabella with the bad call. Yeah, that was probably an offensive foul, but I'm not going to complain. So we'll get the block call and it'll be one to one. Mason Brown will go to the line looking to end the streak. 17 straight by Beaver. Oh, 
Rashad is up and is good, and that does end the 17-0 run by Beaver here in the second quarter. Second one's up, and they don't get the sub in. No, no, they do get the sub in. A little late, but they're going to get the sub in. Maley's going to take a breather and grab it back into the game. It's 34-14, 20-point lead. Here comes Beaver Local the other way. Drive middle by Beaver up, no good. Rebound, offensive rebound again by Beaver. This is where you're really missing Luke Dara, who's in a couple of fouls and foul trouble. Use some of that size inside all and a sloppy pass by Zanes on the inbound and turnover and a good hustle by Mason Brown to get it back. And that's going to be knocked out of bounds. Oh, they're going to call a foul on Beaver Local, and that's going to be a one and one Looks like Pelock or yeah, Pelock will be going to the line. So it's 36-14. 20 seconds now remaining in the second quarter. Zoom in a little bit here. First one's up and good. It's 36-15 now. p gets ready for the second shot. Second one is up and it's good, but they're going to get a line violation on p -Lock. It went across the line before the ball hit the rim. So that one, the second one, will not count. It'll remain 36-15. Panthers now applying some pressure. 17 seconds remaining. Beaver Local handles the pressure pretty easily. Panthers a man-to-man. -man. There's a high screen, double screen now. Kick to the corner. Shot is up and no good. Rebound goes to almost to Gravitz. Loose ball goes to Beaver, tipped away by Zanes, and the clock is going to expire. Clock's going to expire, and it is 36 to 15 at halftime. So the Panthers really struggled there in the second quarter. At one point, it was 17 to 12, and then Beaver went on a, a pretty significant run there in the second quarter, and we're at a 36 to 15 different so 19 to 3 run to end the quarter and uh, let's put the Panthers behind by 21 Pretty quiet here in the Panthers gym at halftime.
All right. Here's the senior banners. I know it's got to be pretty boring if you're still watching it out. There's the senior banners. Even though most of them are blocked by the backboard, but nice senior banners for the class of 19. So we can mess around a little bit. We can get the second camera action going. Mess around and learn how to use this new setup. So this is a different camera. Now. This is actually my cell phone. Hi. Hi, it's off the bleachers here. Yeah, it's recording. I would like to send a shout out to Ann and George Lindsay in Florida. Welcome to, to the broadcast. Glad you're able to watch. Is that your parents? Yeah, they're watching. She's like, stand up and wait. Stand up and wait. <laughs> Here, I can, I can zoom down to you. Hey, uh, Heather. There she is. Bonnerville, Florida. One of the nicest reasons why we do the broadcast here. We got longtime uh, scorekeeper, Mr. Jeff Benton, there next to uh, Heather, who's doing the, the scoreboard this afternoon. And then we have longtime Times Leader and Transfer supporter, uh, Rick DeLuca. Oh, look how nice. There's Ben, who wants something to Heather. Halftime. Officials taking a break down here. It is super quiet. Not a very big crowd here in the Panther Dome this evening. We got some little kids here walking across the court. We're going to do some halftime entertainment. All right, we're going to switch to back to the other camera. Maybe. All right, we're going to disconnect my phone. This new system, we can set up multiple cameras if we needed it. But we're not that high tech yet, but maybe one day. I can't play any music because of YouTube's copyright material. It will block our broadcast if I do. So the rest of the week, the girls are, Varsity girls are home uh, tomorrow. Uh, there, there is wrestling tomorrow as well, uh, away, but the varsity girls will be home against Lindsley tomorrow. Uh, Thursday, the girls will also be home. They'll be playing against Beaver Local, which will be a big Buckeye 8 uh, test for the Panthers, who are currently 3-0 and for the Lady Panthers. Friday, the boys are uh, home against, Mad or excuse me, are away at East Liverpool. All right, the, gr the boys are away at East Liverpool. So lots of action left here. Our next broadcast will be Thursday. We'll have the girls action on Thursday. Uh, no broadcast tomorrow. And then uh, nothing Friday because it is an away game. So 2.50 left until the end of halftime.
All right, 131 here remaining. Now the Panthers are going to have to cut down on turnovers. They're going to have to attack the basket. They're going to have to sprint back on defense, stop those open layups on the fast breaks, and get some rebounds and, and uh, stop the second chance opportunities for Beaver Local. So one minute remaining now, so we're back in action. Okay, we're going to come out, and it's going to be, looks like Panther ball. Uh, the bowling team was in action tonight, too, against Harrison. Haven't heard from Coach Call yet any results. So we'll be looking forward to that. It is 740. Pretty quick game this evening so far. So Panthers ball. Maley will be inbounding to Roberts. Here we go the other way now. Roberts going to inbound downside to Dara. Dara's going to reverse. No good. Rebound to Beaver. Beaver's going to throw it down the court. Panthers are going to hustle back, though. Nice job stopping the break. Here's Reed, who likes to chuck it up from deep. Panthers in the matchup zone. There's a read deep, and that's up and good. So good, not a good start for the Panthers, but a good start for Beaver Local there with the three-pointer on the initial possession. Grab is a triple team here. Nice pass up to Mason Brown, cross court. Crosses over, drives the basket, and gets the lay-in. Nice job by Mason Brown. Here we go the other way now. Drive baseline, shot is up, no good. That'll be Panther ball off of Beaver Local. There's a little crisscross through the middle of the lane. Roberts with the ball top of the key. Roberts going to attack. Almost gets the body call. Maley thought about getting it into Darrett. Does, but it tipped away and out of bounds. It'll be Panther possession. Beaver Local is going to sub in for Reed. There's Maley. Back to Roberts in the corner inside to Dara. Not going to get it. Turnover. Back the other way now. There's a three up, and that's good. That's two threes in a row. It's six nothing run here to Beavers to start the third quarter. Beaver local ball. Panthers are going to apply some pressure. No, it'll be Panthers ball, excuse me. 
Beaver's going to apply the pressure. So Maley's going to pass it out to Mason Brown, ahead to Dara. Back to Brown. Nice job. Give and go. Oh, he can't get the layup to go. Back the other way now. Beaver local. Going to slow it down across half court. Screen, there's the lob in. Ball up and no good. Rebound, offensive rebound. Beaver local in and out. Darrow with the rebound. He gets elbowed. Slapped a little bit out to Maley. Maley's going to pull up, hit the two in and out. Nice rebound, grab it. Nice ball fake. Shot up by Maley. Gets tripped, no foul. Back the other way. Comes the Panthers the other way. Dara over to Mason Brown. Three pointer up and off. Nice rebound by Grabitz. And there's a foul from behind. Nice job by Grabitz getting the carom off the boards and drawing the two shot foul. First shot up and no good. Student section with the neon theme tonight. We're gonna give uh, Noah Harvey the student of the game with his throwback Beaumont shirt from the Footloose production. Eating a taco salad in a bag there. Doesn't know he's on TV, but that's okay. Second shot is up and it's good. And it's 42-18, here comes Beaver the other way. Right through the middle of the lane. Now they're going to set it out and regroup. Looks like he's going to want to drive here. Crossover. Uh, toss out to number two who travels. Oh, my goodness. That was like slow, slow motion traveling. You want to get away with that, you got to go a little faster with the feet. So much needed turnover by Beaver Local. Now the pressure here. It's like a little three-quarter diamond. Roberts on the wing. Have to kick it back over here to Maley. Maley's going to throw it down court to Gravitz. Gravitz is going to throw it to Dara. Tip pass to Brown, but they're going to get Gravitz out of bounds on the sideline there. Right idea. Just ran out of real estate. So the Panthers with some Double team. Beavers, though, throw a cross court, get it up. Uh, Beaver low cross court pass. Ball fake, back cross court again. The deep three up, and that is good by Hilditch. Nice deep shot there. 35 18 now. Grab it. And turnover, loose ball goes to Beaver. Throws it up to Hilditch. He's going to look to to chuck up another one, maybe. Oh, uh, baseline, no help. Dara late on the late on the help as I am in the camera. And that's the hoop and the harm. That's third on Hunter Dara. Maley over, nobody there. Zane's cut away from him, turnover. Here comes Beaver Local the other way. Reverse layup, no good. Mason Brown with the rebound to Stevie Roberts. Roberts slows it down, now kicks it over to the corner to Zane's baseline. Cross court to Mason Brown, shot up for three, is up and good. Nice shot by Mason Brown. Mason Brown's giving some 
good points off of the bench here tonight. Oh, there's a Euro. Oh, they're going to get Dalton Water for a reach. Can't stand that move. I can't, I can't understand how that's not a travel, but what do I know? They like go super slow motion and drag that back foot further than they're supposed to. I don't know. To me, it's a travel, but first shot is up and it's good. It's 49 21. Second shot is up and good. And Beaver now at the half century mark. Beaver's going to pull off the pressure. Beaver local and man to man still, though. Panthers looking to set up this down screen. Smaley with the ball. Oh, cross court to Zane. Zane's going to take one dribble, back cut to Roberts. Roberts. Out of bounds. Another turnover. Buckeye. It was Beaver local the other way now. Three minutes remaining in the third quarter. Pass almost stolen. They're going to get the foul on 31, Dalton Watt. That's going to be his fourth. First one up, no good. Second one is up, and that is good. Now 30-point lead. That's the second time now we inbound, and then they get a sub call. Oh, Roberts with the nice hands. Cross court to Novak. Back to Roberts. Roberts is going to look to drive. Kicks it out to Maley. Maley up for three. No good. We're going to get a foul. Away from the ball on Novak on the rebound. And there's in some foul issues here. It's a fourth team foul to only one for Beaver. Beaver local throws the ball cross court. Oh, the one handed floater hook. No good. Offense rebound again to Beaver Local. There's the jump stop shot, and it is good. 53 21. Maley back over to Mason Brown, on top of the key. Back to Zanes. Brown's going to cut through Roberts to the top of the key. Back cut by Maley. Zane's going to back cut. Nice job. Easy two for the layup. Nice job reading the overplay. Then we come back the other way. Cut it to 30. Beaver Lowe's going to drive baseline. Shot up. No good. Rebound. Mason Brown and the kid from Beaver are going to tie up. And a possession arrow. It's going to be Beaver possession. Oh, backside, nobody there. Up for three and no good. Rebound to Beaver Local again. Beaver Local killing the Panthers on the offensive boards when uh, Dara and company aren't in the game. There's a set three by Reed off, way off. Rebound again to Beaver Local. 
Jump stop, and that's a foul from behind. Two shots. There you get 14, Jake Maley on the personal foul. That'll be five team fouls. And it'll be two shots at the line. 120 remaining in the third period. For thir uh, next one's up, and that is good. Next one up, and that is short. Rebound Mailey. It's 54-23. Panther or uh, Beaver Local over the Panthers. There's Zanes at the top of the key. Over to Mason Brown. Brown's going to drive baseline. Jump stop up. No good. Offensive rebound. Novak had it. Loses it. Beaver Local gains control down the court. We're going to get a travel, though, before the easy two. So Panthers ball side out. 101 remaining in the third quarter. Mason Brown in the corner. Cross court over there to Zane. Zane's going to look inside to Maley in the post. Maley's going to look to fade. Nice dish inside to, to Novak. And Colabella now is going to call that one on the floor. So that'll be second team foul. Panthers going to flatten them out here with a 1-4 set. Brown's going to go deep. Gravitz to the corner. Gravitz is going to get... Get the block on 24. So that'll be three fouls now on the team. The Panthers ball side out. There's a reverse to grab it to Maley. Maley's gonna get bumped. Shake cross court to Brown. Brown with the three, up no good. Uh, Zanes with the rebound almost. Beaver gets possession off and running the other way. And there's an easy two at the other end. This 56-23, 14 seconds remaining in the third period. Gravis is gonna drive and then turn it over. Beaver shoots it the other way, almost makes it. And that's all there is for the third quarter. Move to the fourth quarter, it's all Beaver. There's the cheerleaders. All right, ready for action in the fourth quarter here. p lock Darren Long back into the game, along with Roberts and Novak. Beaver's still playing aggressive defense on the Panthers, man to man. Owen Long looking to penetrate, not there, over to Novak. Novak's gonna drive. Owen Long on the wing, looking inside. Nothing there. Over to Pelock. Long was going to drive. Over to Pelock. The jump stop for three. Up. No good. Got to follow that. Here we go the other way now. 
Oh, we get a collision, no call, and then we get a foul from behind on Stevie Roberts. Shot up, and that's good. 7.20 remaining in the fourth quarter. Shot is up and good. Roberts atop the key. p -lock switching the wings. Owen Long now on the wing. Looking to get the ball inside. Nice cross court to the other team. Here we go the other way. Beaver Local still running. Nice save by Reed. There's the pass to the corner. Back up top. Beaver's going to reset. Beavers with their starters still in the game. There's a kick. Nice job by Dara to break up the play. The possession. 640 remaining in the fourth quarter. It'll be Beaver Locals ball side out. There's Reed heading to the corner. Back up top. Beaver gonna try to hold the ball a little bit. 630 now remaining in the fourth quarter. There's a screen, nice screen on Novak. There's a roll. Nice job by Lance Novak to get the loose ball. Jump ball. Possession's going to be Beaver Local. Beaver Local now going to inbound. There's the lob to the corner to Reed. The set shot up, no good. Rebound tipped by Dara over to Beaver Local in the corner. And Beaver's going to do a wheel action here. There's a ball fake. Corner, three-pointers up. No good. Rebound Beaver, no good. Second shot up, rebound Dara. Here comes Owen Long the other way. Dara with a loose ball off his shoulder. Novak gets the loose ball, and they're going to get a foul on maybe 20. Back to the corner, shot up, and three-pointer is good. It's 58-26. Nice steal by Roberts. And the foul, no call, though. This is a steal. Gets the two. Should have got an and one, maybe. <clears throat> Beaver local the other way now. 5-20 remaining in the fourth quarter. There's the three-pointer up and no good. There's the rebound by Novak. Here comes the Panthers the other way. Oh, there's a three by Novak. Up, no good. p -lock with the rebound. And we're going to get a jump ball. Everybody's not sure what's going on here. <laughs> Maybe going the other way. But Panther ball in the corner. Owen Long up for three. Short. Rebound almost back to Long. Off his fingers. It'll be Beaver's possession with 449 remaining in the fourth quarter.
Oh, nice ball fake drive baseline. Shot not there. Pass cross court. Oh, and they leave the ball back to the corner. And there's Reed again with the set shot. Not there. Beaver again. It's a rebound. Drive baseline. Shot up. Not there. And there's a block by Dara. But they're going to get the foul underneath, I think, on Pelock with the reach. So that'd be the team seventh. The teams will be shooting one to one now. Fifty-nine twenty-eight. Second one up, no good. Here comes the Panthers the other way now. C.B. Roberts with the ball fake. Beaver started to sub in their JV team. Ellen Long with the jump stop shot, not there. Pelock with the rebound, goes up. And collects the foul, he'll be going to the line shooting two. Locked in, drives up, oh, no good. There goes Beaver Local the other way now. Shot up baseline, that is good. And 61 28 now. 350 remaining. Novak from the side, no good, short. There's a three by Beaver Local. There's 331 left. Fourth quarter, and we're going to get subs in. And we're going to get a timeout, I think. will be Panther possession. We got Zanes, Cameron Best, Zach Flesh, Ethan McHugh, and Hunter Dara in the lineup. So quite a few freshmen. There's Flesh, kicks it back. Oh, turnover, going the other way. Oh, all fake turns. Let's see, shot up. Nope. Beaver's going to be patient. There's the lob inside. Shot is up. No good. Rebound back to Beaver. We're going to get offensive foul. There's Mr. O'Connell doing his best Dave Green impersonation. There he is. Okay, dragging his foot with the towel. He can moonlight for a custodian. All right, we're back in action. Here comes Zanes with the ball front court. Cross court to Cameron Best. Back this side to Zach Flesh. Back over to Best. The ball's going to be tipped away. Hunter Dara is going to be on it. We're going to get a travel. Here 
Here comes the inbound. Over to Dara. Oh, backside is going to be tipped out by Beaver Local. There's a pass inside to Dara, kicks it out to Flash. Nice ball fake. Shot is up and no good. Rebound. Dara fighting for it. Gets a loose ball up and in. 64 30, 221 remaining. <clears throat> Not sure what Beaver Local is doing here. They got some JV guys in, and now they got three varsity starters coming back in. Rebound Flesh coming this way now. Over to Zane. Zane's going to bring it across half court to Ethan McHugh who's going to lose the ball out of bounds. Another turnover for the Panthers. So this is like Beaver Local doesn't dress too many guys. Looks like they only have nine guys dressed, so there's the kick out. There's a three up, and that's good. Number five's got a couple threes. Luke Cheap Talk, one of the starting five. Flush baseline shot up, no good. Rebound goes to Beaver Local. Back the other way, 130 now remaining. Deep pass uh, stolen by McHugh. Here comes McHugh the other way. Stolen back by Beaver Local. Beaver Local now going to drive Back to the corner. She talk. Oh, cross court. Almost a turnover. Back inside. Number two up and good. Beaver Local extends to a 39 point lead. Zanes picks up his dribble, and that's a turnover the other way. And layup no good. Rebound to best. Back to Zanes. Over to Flesh for three. In and out. Rebound Dara. What? He caught a foul on. That is a crazy call from half court. They're going to get the foul call on, on Dara, Hunter Dara underneath. I'm not sure about that one, but they're going to be shooting two or one and one the other way. We are 43 and a half seconds till the game is over. Shot up, no good. Here we come back the other way. It's 69 to 30. Here comes Zanes inside to McHugh. McHugh up baseline. Shot up. No good. Rebound Dara. Back out to Best. Best for three. Up. No good. Rebound goes to Beaver Local. Loose ball. Hunter Dara on the floor. Nice job to Zanes. Cross court to Reed from Beaver. And now we come back the other way. And there's 18 seconds now. And it looks like the Beavers are just going to be happy with their 39 point victory. Panthers were in it for look, roughly a quarter and a half and then the second quarter just killed them at the end a 19 to two run and that was it for the Panthers. Well, once again, we'll be back in action on Thursday. Girls game, girls will be home against Lindsley tomorrow night. But we won't be broadcasting tomorrow because I won't be able to be here. But Thursday night, we will be here. Uh, and we will be broadcasting the girls game against Beaver Local. So thanks for watching. Good night and go Panthers.